So this is going to be a part two to the Logan Hoskinson time-lapse video that we just did. Um, seven paintings that I did inspired by CNFTs that I've purchased and collected over the last few months. Um, picked some out with my daughter and kind of played with the ones that I really like and just started doing the oil painting, um, getting inspired by that. And I wanted to share with you the adventure that leads up to where I'm at right now. Um, so I spent a lot of time just kind of throwing the computer up and listening in to um, Project Catalyst, um, town halls and meetings, going in to do cohort meetings, um, but it's really good for me to, to meditate and think and, and work through all of that. So uh, at this point, here's where I started taking pictures. Uh, just this morning, the sky was bright. We had overhead light. Um, I know it's middle of winter, so I couldn't get direct overhead light as far north as I live. But we had good ambient cover without casting shadows. And I took my um, really nice camera, put it on a tripod, and set it straight over top of a mat to orient the view and zoom down into it. That's how I got the digital pictures of my oil paintings so that I can transfer them into CNFTs. All of those videos, or all those camera pictures into files. I took three pictures of each one. Um, I had to go through those and figure out which three took just right. Sorted through those and kind of, I didn't delete them, I just moved the ones that I liked up and off of that screen. And that was my ideal picture. To Microsoft Paint, which is a program that I know, I opened up each file individually in Paint, zoomed out so that the screen was there, uh, slid it over, select all, crop, cut, and uh, trimmed it down to the point where the image that I wanted to reproduce and make into the NFT was exactly what we had. So it's a little bit tedious and not, probably not the most professional level. There may be other techniques and skills that can be done, but this is the way that I knew how to do it, and that's what I'm delivering. So that is Mr. Oscar. Well, let's introduce you to the set. First, we have Jigpaw. Uh, this was I was very fortunate to mint. Um, I was online. I think I picked it up with a uh, hotspot on my laptop in my truck. So I happened to be in the right place at the right time. Second is Cardano Trees. Uh, if you know me, you know that I was in on day one minting. Uh, this one in particular is from Canada, which is a very nearby to my great-grandparents' home. And it's a double gamma, and I just love this one. So I picked this one up on the aftermarket because of where it's geolocated and because it's a double gamma. Next is the duo with Planet Pixel and Glacier 3. So Planet Pixel is um, a reward that I received for staking with Stake for Nature. And Glacier is uh, one of the art pieces from Howdle. Um, I'm fortunate enough to have picked up all five. I have a full set. Uh, but Howdle is actually recently featured in DreamSpace. Um, so it's kind of neat that I was already working on this one as that one kicked off. And I made that a dual image, um, put the two together because I like the way that those played well together. Um, next is the Armada Alliance. This one is near and dear to my heart. Um, and I kind of did, did that one with the dual colors. And, uh, yeah, I, I really do like the way this one turned out. Uh, Mantle Bros. I picked this actual one up, 08490. Uh, during the um, Halloween, I think there was like a three hour window where you could pick up, maybe it was an hour, the a guarantee of fire one. So I definitely meant that one and picked that up. And next is Unsig 07631. This is my rendition of oil and it's probably one of the most difficult oil paintings I've ever done trying to duplicate something. Um, Unsigs comes out, if I was doing airbrush, this would have been super easy, but to do it on oil on a 12 by 12 canvas was rather tricky um, but i still like the way it came out i like the way it turned um, a little bit of, it isn't perfect it isn't exact but it is exactly what turned out from my mind to my hand and there it is and finally logan hoskinson 182 so from the cardano characters um, package and I picked this one up it was actually minted because you own it and I like the way that it works out. And this is one that my daughter picked out as one that she wanted in my collection that she really wanted to see me do. And, uh, yeah, it was fun to, fun to do a rendition of um, Charles and to try and mimic some excellent artwork that uh, Justin Cruz puts out. 
And there you have it. That is my collection of seven. Uh, this is the second part of this video series. Next, I'm going to venture into NFT Maker Pro and get the Mint set up because this is going to launch on Solstice, which is only a few days away. We'll see where we go from there. Thank you very much. I appreciate your time and attention. And don't forget to like and subscribe and save. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.